Hey folks, welcome back to the mountain. I'm Tony from Gagnus Mountain Homestead. As you can see, we're in the woods. I got my wood miser hat on, and I got some oak logs over here that I'm going to bring over to mill. We're going to cut them up. Today, we're going to show you milling with milling some oak using our new grapple that we haven't used before for the sawmill, and it's one of the main reasons we bought it. So here we go. We lift the log this way, one end is off the ground, so when we drag it through, only one end is dragging through the dirt, and it'd be easy to brush off instead of dirt packing in through the whole thing. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out of the woods now. You can see we're by the mill now. We got a lot, our logs stacked up over there. We got our oak logs. There's one that was kind of bowed, so if we need it, we'll cut it. If not, it's firewood, because we need that too. So let's go ahead and get this, lo this log on the mill. You'll see how much easier things are with the grapple. It's amazing. <laughs> That is so much easier than the forks. It's incredible. I love that grapple. We've used it for quite a bit. We'll show you some more video of that coming up, but that's amazing. So, so much easier. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start cutting this thing.
uh, just take a look at the grain of this stuff. I don't know what, how well you're going to be able to see this, but look at that. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous wood. This is going to be a beautiful table. No knots, perfectly clean wood. It's just absolutely gorgeous. We're being very careful with this. But look at that wood, huh? Ooh, that's going to be a gorgeous table. All right, let's get this piece off. We're going to flip it over and cut the next two. All right. We'll put you guys over here this time. Look at that stuff. Absolutely gorgeous. Apparently, it likes gasoline. Imagine that. So, I'm not the only thing that has gas. Apparently, the mill needs it too. Okay, we're full. Try this again, shall we?
is the last one. So folks, um, I hope you enjoyed me cutting this uh, oak today. Um, I took a lot longer than I normally do. I just wanted to make sure that my dimensions were exact. So each of these is exactly two inches by eight inches. Um, I took my time with it. I cut slow to make sure I didn't get any divots or anything, make sure I didn't hit anything. Um, this oak is absolutely gorgeous. The reason why we wanted to cut this is I'm going to be sending this to a kiln and it's going to be dried um, and at that point it's going to go to a master carpenter friend of mine who's going to be building us a farm table out of this oak. We wanted to build the table off from oak that we cut down on this property. Um, you saw me hauling the logs out of the woods earlier. This is going to cut them. I'm going to cut some two by sixes out of the other ones and we're going to have a farmer's table built for us. So those will be upcoming videos of that. I just wanted to show my little LT15 here cutting this oak. It does a wonderful job. Um, I went slow just to make sure the cuts are all even, straight. I just wanted everything to be perfect for this lumber. So that's going to be that's going to do it for today's video, folks. Uh, you know what to do with our videos. Like them, share them. Tell everybody about us. Give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment. I know I'm not perfect on my sawmill. I know I have a lot to learn still. I do it for my own uh, my own purposes, uh, and I help friends out with it too. But it's another video and another story. So we'll t we'll see you on the next video. And as always, God bless.